Hi, I'm Peter Haddock and welcome here to a beautiful sunny day at Miller Groundbreaking in Newcastle upon Tyne. It's normally freezing up here, folks, but I brought the sunshine today because I'm going to be talking about the brand new GTS quick coupler and also its larger GTX, which is the brand new similar version, but for heavy duty excavators like this one. Now, this is the home, folks, of the quick coupler. Miller groundbreaking with the first business in the world to introduce the quick coupler. And guess what? Walking around the factory today, they've been doing a lot of innovation. Their team in there has been designing a whole new range. And this includes the GTS. Now the GTS, this quick coupler here, has been designed with all of the customers in mind those people that are working with this type of excavator to do lots more work, using buckets, using different attachments to get through their workday and to get through their projects. But I'm no expert, folks, around the new GTS, but I know somebody who is, and they're gonna be joining me. That person is Barry, and he is the product specialist at Miller Groundbreaking that has been part of bringing this new range to market. And we're going to find out all about the intricacies of why this makes it a world leader. And Barry, what on earth is this innovation? I never expected to go small and miniature. And, you know, people in this sector uh, with the small to medium size excavators, they're people that are working in and around uh, lots of different utilities and spaces. And so space and innovation goes together now, doesn't it, with the Miller Coupler? Tell it, me about it. It does indeed. I, I think that's a sign of the times. You know, you said it yourself, you know, from a, from a large excavator point of view, quick couplers have become the norm. Yeah. But what we're seeing is that's transitioning down to the likes of the compact areas, which has predominantly been manual couplers. But now that we're seeing more and more inquiries from a fully hydraulic quick coupler and all the benefits that that has from a safety and a productivity point of view. Yeah, and I see a lot of machines this size now um, actually on utilities, compact radius machines. Yeah. But, you know, you're wanting and needing to perhaps use quite a lot of attachments. You know, so you're talking about people making the switch that have already got a quick coupler here to this one. And we'll talk about how much lighter it is and, and, and some of the elements of how that works. But you're also talking to people that have never had a quick coupler solution before, aren't you, Barry? Exactly. Yeah. Tell me about that. If you see one of the first benefits when you look at this uh, quick coupler is the universal nature of it. Right. So with regards to a manual, often manuals are just dedicated so you can just pick up your standard buckets. This offers a whole array of universality. Um, it can pick up multiple attachments, which means that when you go to site, all you have to do in the back of your trailer is put in your buckets, your ditching bucket, your breaker, then you go to site and you can quickly change over those attachments in literally 18 seconds. So if you think about how much that could save you in a whole day, you know, this pays for itself. Now, Barry, before we go into the details of this, I've heard from people where they might look at quick couplers and go, it's not for me because of the rocking horse yep. issue with the fact that some of these can add a lot of weight to the front of a machine. And obviously weight's important when you're transporting something like this on a trailer as well exactly. with all your attachments. Yep. But it's not gonna be the case, is it, with the GTS? Tell me why. It's not, it, it, you've, when we look at this and when we did the design element of it, that was one of the first fundamental design uh, areas that we focused on. Now, you rightly said, as soon as you put any sort of weight on the end of your machine, you have to be concerned about the machine stability. Yeah. What we've done is because of the way that we've casted it, we've been able to save some real weight on this. In some cases, when we've benchmarked it against the competition, this is 60% lighter than the competition. Though those are fabricated units. Right. Because we've went into actual casting, we've been able to put strength where we've needed it and also to create lightweight areas of this. So if you think that's a real save and benefit for our customers. Of course, safety for me is absolutely the number one thing. I don't care what anybody says. If you're on a construction site, you need to be safe. Yeah. And this is where the design elements come in of what's inside here, folks. Tell me about what you've put inside 
this really compact, lightweight, quick coupler that is going to make safety a natural thing. Yep. Well, let's start with the fundamental that this is an ISO 13031 safe coupler. Right. Now, what that means is we've got a twin locking system. So you've got your front latch and you've got your rear hook that makes sure that the bucket is, remains firmly intact. Now, what we've got is quite a novel ISO poppet valve around here. Okay. Which, when you attach on the bucket, that rides over the bucket pin and that makes sure that it remains in a safe position. If for some reason you were to get some form of hydraulic failure, yep, right, because line, you've yeah. got that ISO lock, that's gonna keep that bucket in place safely. So if my lines go down, if I get a burst pipe or something like that, yes. then we're not gonna have the bucket dropping off. Exactly. That, because that is a big worry for people that aren't used to understanding what a quick coupler actually does. Yep. And so tell me a little bit about how that works then if I'm inside the cab. So folks, let's go inside the cab and just think about how this will actually work for the operator when they're sat in there, Barry. Okay. Come on. And of course, one of the real benefits, Barry, of the new GTS coupler for a machine of this size is the fact you don't have to get out of the cab to go onto the manual and then change your bucket. You can do it all from inside the cab and for me, that's another critical safety element. But of course, with any product, it's all about how it works. And what are the procedures and processes for somebody sitting in a Bobcat like this to work the quick coupler from inside the cab? Yep. I mean, the fundamental part of the quick coupler is being safe inside the cab. It's being able to change your attachments while having that security inside. And what we do with any quick coupler system here is we've got it so you have to have a safe curl to release procedure. So what that means is that you will curl your bucket in and you can only release it in that safe position. So that is all about how this attachment's actually connected into the machine and the hydraulics then, isn't it, Barry? Yes, it is. It, we as Miller don't just focus on what the coupler does. We also talk, think about the installation kit. We think about the safety of the switching system. Ultimately, it's keeping our customers safe. And the great thing about that, folks, is this is designed not just for this Bobcat we see here today. The new GTS is designed for the industry. So you've just watched this video, folks, and that's the best few minutes you've ever, ever had in your entire life because you're going to be able to save hours switching to the GTS from Miller Groundbreaking. Thanks very much.